Hello everybody, welcome to my channel, Pretty Aura here. This reading is called The Emergency Room. What in your energy needs to be addressed immediately? Um, a lot of the times we have spiritual issues that manifest themselves as uh, physical and mental issues. So what I'm going to be doing during this reading is helping you to attack these issues head on. I'm going to be um, referring to you recommendations on how you could um, overcome these obstacles mentally, spiritually, and physically. Okay. Uh, you're watching this video if you are a Pisces, Sun, Moon, or Rising, and you're also watching this video, um, even Venus, and you're also watching this video if you are um, looking for answers in reference to a Pisces. Um, Pisces, what I am gathering here is... Um, a, a, a feeling of determination, the eye of the tiger, eye of the tiger. Um, I got the eye of the tiger. Who is that? I don't know if that's Katy Perry. Um, you're going to hear me roar. Um, I don't know if you have Leo in your chart, but this is really like going for the gusto, going after, you know, um, especially um, success. This is this is what I'm feeling, right? Um you may um, have Aries in your chart as well, um, some type of fire in your chart. Either way, there is um, a, a strong energy of determination, okay? I would just say, Pisces, check over your thoughts. Make sure they are yours and make sure you're being motivated positively, okay? And um, not just um, because you're operating out of um, a competition type energy, okay? With the win or lose here in a spiritual uh, spiritual position, okay? So <clears throat> mentally, you want to take control of your life. There could have been something that you were going through and you're just like, oh no, not, not anymore, okay? There's some type of stepping up, like I am stepping up. With the eye of the tiger uh, energy I'm getting, I would definitely, um, and I have uh, even wrote down as a note that you guys need to be using tiger's eye, okay? Tiger's eye and carnelian, okay? Um, this is going to help you to um, hone in on, on, on your creativity and your personal power. Um, you guys want to really uh, make sure that you are getting um, crystals also that are associated with your solar plexus. That's where your personal power and your self-esteem lies, okay? So mentally, you are l leading and going the distance and trying to take control of your life. There's, there seems like... Um, Time is of the essence. Look at that. <laughs> As I say, time is of the essence. Time to go pops out. Look at that. Chop wood is at the bottom of the deck. So you guys are feeling like, listen, I got to get it together, okay? That's a beautiful energy to actually be in. Um, you may be pursuing something legal legally for some of you guys, okay? But um, there is... Uh, an energy of feeling like I got to I got to get to work. And like I said, this is a beautiful energy during this um, time, you know, because everything is on pause and to actually be coming out of an energy of anxiety or, or whatever it is that you guys are coming out of that I'm feeling. This is a beautiful energy to be in because it's like I'm not going to be swayed by or I'm not going to be a product of my envir environment. I'm not going to succumb to the uh, chaos that is around me. I'm going to actually take lead and control of my life and I'm going to get out there and make it do what it do. Okay. <laughs> um, Hold on one second. Surrender to setting limits. It is healthy to set boundaries and relationships. Practice expressing your needs and remember that no is a complete sentence, which is very interesting because over here, Pisces, I see that in a love situation, you may literally have been like... Um, In a situation where you didn't see a person for who they were and now you're not allowing them to see you okay so this is literally like you could have blocked this person okay and now you're mastering your heart trying to get over this healing so it's interesting to see surrender to setting limits because this is about creating a boundary and this is in a physical physical position okay 
so mentally you know you're over here like i'm not gonna allow anything or anyone to control me i'm not gonna be you know um subservient i just heard anymore okay now spiritually it seems like you guys can even have been in some type of spiritual war or you could spiritually um actually be in heavy prayer or um for some reason there's if i feel like time is of the essence again i'm gonna say it and it's like i have to go for what i know i have to go for what i want for, for somebody someone may have been trying to take something from you okay um I'm not sure what this is about uh, in that respect, but I really feel like there is a stepping up, okay? A taking of control, taking back your power sort of situation with the win or lose in the spiritual position. All that glitters is not gold. And then you have coming to the edge um, at the bottom, it really, it really seems like, you know, especially with this situation in a reference to a relationship, it could be love, family, or other, even cutting people off with the knife here. Okay. Spiritually, it's like, listen, okay. I, I, okay. Someone was a narcissist. Okay. It's like, I'm cutting you off. You're not what I thought you were. <laughs> I thought you were gold. You were not. Okay. I've come to the point in my life where I need to make a decision. I just said earlier, you are going the distance. We have going the distance here, okay? So spirit is confirming. Listen, I had it's like you had to make a decision. Someone had to make a decision. Someone may have literally ran away, <laughs> okay, from a person. Someone may have literally ran away from a person and it could have had a, to do with a love relationship. It's like someone tried to control you or have rule over you or something like that. And it's like, now you're stepping up saying no, <laughs> okay? Taking back your power. This is beautiful, okay? Um, I wanna uh, stress to you guys to, um, to get some black tourmaline or black obsidian. That's gonna help you to cut ties and also protect yourself. You may wanna even uh, wear two, the, both of those crystals together. Um, Yes. Surrender to receiving support and love. Allow the love and support of others in rather than trying to handle everything yourself. This can take the pressure off you and simultaneously nurture you. You also have surrender your ego at the bottom of the deck. And remember I said earlier, make sure you're acting out of, not out of um, competition, okay? Spirit is confirming yet again. Don't act out of competition. Make sure that um, you are trying to succeed. You're seeking success because you love yourself, not because this person or, you know, people want to see you down, okay? Not because you're having conflict with others. Um, you know, wanting this success for yourself. Make sure you're fighting for yourself, okay? Because if we slip into this uh, energy of the ego, we could kind of uh, feed the energy of um, conflict. And that's not something that we want to do, okay? Um, keep a piece of, I would say, angelite on you, okay? This is going to call in for you to receive support and love from the angels, all right? Um, it looks like you are trying to, you know, like do everything yourself and that's beautiful, but spirit is saying, listen, um, we actually have your back. Let us, let us help. <laughs> okay. Let us help. Okay. Um, A big ego can work against you, but humility will further your goals, okay? So this is what I was saying. You could actually, you know, you're going to get far, it looks like, Pisces, with this energy of determination. But you, the Spirit is saying you can go far, further, farther, further. <laughs> but humility will further your goals, okay? 
So staying on the right side of karma and being very humble is going to take you further than what you even thought, where, where you even thought you could go, Pisces, okay? All right. So now physically, um, physically, Pisces, like I said, it looks like you may be refusing to see someone. I just heard Cinderella. Wow, Cinderella was, there's an energy of a time, like I said before, it's like time being of the essence. I don't know why I'm feeling like a rushed, gotta go, gotta go, gotta go right now, hurry up, uh, get out of here, or like I said, with this energy, it's like someone could have snuck off um, and, you know, actually had to try to run away. Um, I just keep hearing that time is of the essence, okay? Uh, I would I would really stay in heavy prayer, you guys, um, and asking for help from the universe, source, God. Like you guys are trying to master your emotions, trying to clean up your heart after you know whatever situation that I that it feels like that you guys are coming out of something. Phoenix rising from the ashes type of feeling, okay. between worlds between worlds you guys are trying look like, like i just said I, I feel like you guys just came out of something do you see this energy where it's like coming from the dark into the light here it's like you know you see all the uh the the confetti right the confetti the celebration on this side so you're in between and, and, and it's like coming to coming to the edge it's like i'm i gotta run away you're trying to get out of this energy and 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 you're successful okay you are and will be successful so this is beautiful wow okay coming out of feeling anxiety feeling trapped a little bit i guess and feeling under control under someone's or something's rule okay but now it's like listen I'm between worlds. This may be in reference to a Gemini, or you may have Gemini in your chart with the double with the double situation. I'm I'm seeing a lot of doubles. Are you a twin? There's a lot of doubles here that I'm seeing. Okay. There's a lot of doubles. Look at that. Double, double, double. Okay. Double and double. This may have to do with a Gemini. Okay. Or a Libra. Something, something about doubles. Okay, so it looks like you're actively trying to get out of a situation. Okay, and you are going to be successful. I see it. You want to stay determined. That carnelian and the tiger's eye is going to keep you uh, determined. Um, you guys, there's no need to ask questions it seems like and you're not even asking questions anymore it looks like you guys were trying to figure out something or you know why would this person do this to me or why did i have to go uh through that um spirit just wants to confirm listen don't ask okay don't stay in the vibration of going back and wanting to know why okay just continue to move forward you're being pushed Surrender stubbornness, okay? This is what I was this is what I was thinking here. All right. Um, if you're tensing up or taking a rigid stance about something, gently observe it, observe yourself and become more yielding. This will help you communicate more lovingly with others and yourself. You see what I'm saying? Because I just picked up that there was an energy of asking why, but why? This will pull you back. This will pull you back. Don't even ask why, okay? It's not your job to understand people. It's not your job to understand why you went through what you went through um, as far as um, if a, if this was projected upon you by a person, if someone did something to you, okay? Um, you're going to understand in time, okay? Divine timing. But don't uh, let you questioning the situation um, or the universe pull you back into this energy because you're you're going forward and, you're, and you will be uh, successful. Surrender the drama. I told you this, Pisces. <laughs> Surrender the drama. Again, 
two wolves. We have doubles, okay? That may mean something for somebody. No matter how emotionally charged the situation, remain calm and don't contribute to the drama. Staying centered will help resolve the issue more quickly. This is what I was saying over here about acting out of your ego. Just go forth and be great. Don't even look back. Don't look back to, to throw your middle finger up <laughs> at these people, okay? Because I'm sensing some type of conflict and it may have to do with a relationship with all the doubles that I'm seeing here, okay? Um, or something with your DNA. It could be with family, okay? It could be something with the DNA, with this strand here. Um, Pisces, this is this is beautiful, <laughs> okay? This is beautiful um, and I really wish you guys the best. Um, you can um, actually search for a mantra for power and success. You can listen to success mantras. This is going to keep you going. Um, you can even, you know, put it on your put it on in your TV and put it to a uh, to blast it or you know play it in your headphones because this will help you to ride that wave of energy, um, pr pros energy and successful energy that you are looking to thrive off of. Okay, Pisces? Thank you.